Hello everyone, welcome. This is Wendy and today we are doing a spring kitchen tour for 2023. So without further ado guys, let's get started. First up is my vignette here. This is my favorite little shelf I picked up from Hobby Lobby years ago. It's a staple in my kitchen. And then next up I have are these canisters, which are already done, but I just turned them around. Um, I have a couple of mugs in here um, that I purchased from the local thrift store. And then, of course, I have my favorite mugs. I just uh, found these maybe about a week ago or so. They're Kate Spade polka dots. I'm a big fan of polka dots. I think they're timeless. They never go out of style. And I love them. So I purchased those. And these are on display here as well. And I just added a little bit of greenery to kind of spruce it up a little bit. So that is the first vignette that I have here. And then the next area that I decided to decorate was above the refrigerator. And it's just a wooden, just a basket I picked up at a local thrift store about a week ago too. And I have some lamb's ears in there and have some candlestick holders, three of those in the black. And those are threshold, but I picked them up, picked those up from the local Goodwill. Then the next area is the next vignette is this little lamp here and these beads. And I'm pretty sure this tray came from Hobby Lobby with the little black feet. It's had there for a while. And this lamp and beads and the book all came from a local thrift store. And then I just have then I just have my little wine opener here. That's that little vignette. And then next up is the kitchen uh, range here. And I just purchased some of these little towels from Hobby Lobby, of course. That's one of my favorite places to shop. And I did the basil and sage. And these were $6.99 each at 40% off. So I love those. And now we're moving on into my little crop here. And just picked up the orange scones. That is from Hearth and Hand, I'm sure. Adds a little recipe on there and adds a little whisk that was gold. Add a little touch to it. And just my wooden spoons and utensils there. And then this board, cutting board, marble. I picked it up at my secret closet probably about two years ago. Then I have my little spoon rest here. So that is this little vignette. And now we're moving on to the little cookbook stand area. And I have that. I just turned the page on that to give it a black background with uh, caramelized onion, goat cheese, and rosemary. Sounds pretty good. And then I have this here, staple in my kitchen. And then I have my Kate Spade little creamer and a little snuffer here. And let me show you a secret with this. This is just a little plant. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure I thrifted this as well. And this is a little cake spade creamer. I love this too. So I just added the little greenery there and there you have that little vignette. Then here's just the basics, the little cleaner for your hands, and the hand soap, which I love the black and white. And then of course my little cute little ducks I picked up at the Goodwill for 49 cents. I'm gonna give him a little home right there. I think he looks so happy there. And 
And next up is this little area here. Just a little birdhouse that I've thrifted at the Goodwill. Love the green. See the tag is still on it. Well, it was. Then my mother in love, that plant stays there. And then this, found, I found this at Hobby Lobby as well. How adorable is that? Little birdhouse. I love the tin roof on it. I think it's so cute. And the colors and the little bird on top. So we're just going to place him right back where he needs to go. That is that and the, another vignette here. And this little tray came from Hobby Lobby. Uh, granary, I've been had this. I have no idea where I haven't got this from. It's that old. Then I have my little Tranquil. It was $6.99 at Hobby Lobby. Little essential oils. It is ginger root and ying flower. It smells amazing. It really does. And this was 40% off of $6.99. This was asked to order it off Amazon. And this here is just a cutting board from Hobby Lobby. This was actually inspiration for the theme that I decided to go with. I love the green. I love the sage colors. So this is really where I got the idea. So you have that. And now we're just moving over to the coffee bar. And it's very simple, but I love it. Real clean. And here I just picked up another towel. This one's a rosemary. And it came from, of course, Hobby Lobby for $6.99, 40% off. And this is just a neutral towel I have over there. And then I have these beautiful mugs, which my sister, she gifted those to me. I love them. She gifted those to me and my husband. My husband and I. And just a little hot coffee sign. And my little cloach here, which is empty. I need to fill it with a little sweet treat or something, I'm sure. And over here is the other matching mug. And the other ducky. I think he looks quite content over here. And then the little um, canvas that I keep my coffee pods in. And I add a little bit of greenery. And this is Ray Dunn too. Just turn it around. I love repurposing, guys. I love to repurpose. Alright, so that is the coffee bar. And then just below I just have, um, of course, the lamb's ear and then here this little basket here was thrifted at the local thrift store thought that was cute and I just added the copper cups to those and my staple little copper houses those came from Hobby Lobby on clearance as well This is just a table runner that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. It was $8.99 at 40% off, of course. I like the lightness of it. And then we have this little table, <clears throat> table stand or riser. It was from Target. Yeah, Target. And then, of course, I thrifted these gold candlestick holders. And then the candles itself come from Hobby Lobby 169. And I know you can't really see it too good. It's a little rainy here in North Carolina. But these are a sage color green as well. And then here for my planner, it's just a planner I picked up from Hobby Lobby. And it was $17.99, but it was on clearance for $4.49. 
And then I just added some little ivy. And some of these here, which is so popular. Added those. So that's how I came up with that. And then next up is the napkins here. And these are from, are from World Market. And then these little gold little designs here. These are actually, I'm going to walk back over here for a second. These are actually from the wedding area at Hobby Lobby where you do your boutonnieres. It's like 12 in a little bundle for $3.99. That is what I added for this area here. Just to kind of jazz it up a little bit. And this napkin holder ring, I've had this for a while. And then next are these plates I took from the local Goodwill. Excuse me for noise. And they have a sage color in them as well. They were only 99 cents. And just a basic white plate, which everybody should have just a basic white plate, I think. Then, of course, the charger from Hobby Lobby, gold trimming. And then the placemat was on clearance from Hobby Lobby spring of last year. So, there you have that. And that is my tablescape for 2023 spring. And mind you, these napkins, they were on clearance as well for $2 each at World Market. So you really can repurpose things. You can put the old with the new.